All right, Spencer, get us up to date because I missed a bit. So uh, catch me up if you would. Last time we met, our heroes had been journeying in the belly of the beast, the mysterious and mythical Infinifish. After Sharpie found what looked like a lung, the group rejoined and entered through a large cavity that Quark had slashed in the side of the great organ. Entering the lung, a slimy creature had dropped in from the ceiling onto the bottom of this chamber, followed by several electrical spidery minions. After the dust of combat had settled, Sharpie, Quark, and Mulrain were victorious. Hoping to damage the lung with the smoke from their smokesticks, Sharpie and Mulrain ignited them as well as all their torches. And as the damage was being dealt to the vicious lung, Quark destroyed the remnants with his flaming sword, and together they all fell below back into the chamber before they had left. Ah, uh, yeah. They had made some progress, but where would they proceed from here? Thank you, Spencer. Yeah. All right. So, uh, Seems yeah. Seems like now yeah, that he's, a, he's, a big, he's a big rap star now, so he's phoning in his DMing. Uh, no, you know, I just no, I, lost I, my place in the writing, reading. He sounds like uh, Don LaFontaine now, like the inner world. Like, yeah. he's, he's kicking back. He's Snoop style now. He's yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. In a world, boy. You in found a sewer. world. Okay, so you, got, you guys basically beat up the lungs, right? You lungs? beat up yeah. some lungs. Okay, so now we're sitting in, in a room. With, are we in the stomach now? You're in that room you were in before with the three different passways. Um, Sharpie took the left, you took the middle, and Moraine took the right, and then you magically decided to go back to where Sharpie was, you know? Right. Yeah. So you're in that room. Obvious exits uh, north, south, and east, and west will take you back to the village. Where, uh, where have we not been before? You, you've been through all of them. Right. But you guys just caught back up with Sharpie when you we, thought he was... Are we still with that, lungs, so we still with that far sword guy, or he go away? He's still around, yeah. Okay. Uh, he's hanging out. What's up, guys? I'm Valicent, the sword guy. Hey, Valicent. All right, well, let's go back to... Uh, we, we, we came through a lung door, so let's not go through that one. Yeah, you, the, the one you were through had a hanging kidney bean-shaped organ, if you'll recall. All right. So I mean, that's, then, the, that's the kidneys, right? But I mean, I can't tell you. I do, I, I, I I rush headlong, barbarian style, into the kidney. Rushing kidney. headlong through the passageway, you find yourself in a large pinkish room, which I'm about to explain. This passage has a high ceiling from which is hanging a large, shiny, veined-looking sack of flesh in the shape of a kidney bean. And the several arteries run from various walls into the dangling organ, and a huge central cord seems to be its main support coming in from the ceiling. You can see what appear to be large white-blue sparks with multiple limbs slowly crawling around the surface of the organ. A greenish tangle of cords appears to be blocking the only other exit. Dun, dun, dun. The spark things, these are these spider things that repair everything and also will attack us if we start fucking around. Oh, yeah, they're awesome. like an immune response or something. All right, like so I, I, uh, we want to attack that main cord that's holding it up there, right? Probably. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, do we, uh, okay, Valicent, use your far sword and take a swipe at that cord. I don't know if you remember, but my far sword's all used up. I, I wasn't I there, man. arrows. You were there. You just forgot. Oh. Sorry. I, I unsheath my arrows. I, I show them to Quark. I say, like, hey, remember? I got it. I arrows. How, how could I forget? I fire a single uh, good arrow at the thing. At the kidney bean? Yep. You miss. By the way, there was a dude. Did you talk to the dude who brought, he made props. He made, he, he made, a, he made a mole rain arrow. It's a double, double arrow. Let's get him up here. Can I be holding it? Maybe it will, will make me better. <laughs> He's coming up. He made a thing. What's your name, sir? Luke. Luke. Luke likes to make little props, and he made. Can you? Uh, this is. Uh, she fires two arrows, so I made two arrows. Adventure. And the heads of the arrows are four-sided dice. And, the most uh, dangerous of all dice. <laughs> and you also made what I thought was a joke about putting a sharpie in my butt. It's it a was. wand, <laughs> right? It's made out of sharpies. It's a wand made out of sharpies that does ray of frost way better than ray of frost. All right, great. Thank you. Was it Luke? Yes. Yeah. Thank you, Luke. Oh, all right. <laughs> I, I cast a spell of uh, th of thanking him. Uh, Spencer, how, how far above the ground is this uh, kidney thing hanging? I'd say it's about 10 feet above your heads. Hmm. 
Uh, I get on, uh, I jump onto Sharpie's shoulders and take out my flaming sword and take a swipe at the underbelly of the kidney. Slashing at the underbelly, you score a flaming hit. Fuck yeah. Just as soon as the gash has been made, however, those spidery creatures I was mentioning earlier crawl over the surface of the organ. So we gotta, we gotta kill those things first then, right? Probably. Well, I mean... Yeah, like AIDS. You, you want us to give the infinite fish AIDS? Um, I... I don't have AIDS. I'm me fucking it doesn't give it AIDS. That's true. That's not how AIDS... Wait, 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 wait. Spencer, do I have AIDS? No. Okay. Do I have a spell that would work on organisms like that? Like these sparky like a, things? A kid, oh, uh, like on the sparky charm things. Charm person wouldn't work on that. That's for humanoids only. Definitely right? not. Charm person. I mean, you could probably rule out illusions. Hip, you hip, hip, hypnotism eyes. won't work on them. That'd be an illusion. Yeah. I, I have the power to summon animals. Can I summon an AIDS monkey? An AIDS monkey? <laughs> Can I summon some sort of like... I should of... clarify, you don't have the power to summon things, just talk to them. Oh. So if there's a squirrel around and you're like, yo, is there a squirrel around? I look, like, I look yeah. around for AIDS-ridden animals. Suspiciously, all AIDS-ridden animals are absent. How convenient. Maybe Spencer, they're at a support can I, group. Can I shoot two arrows at the uh, kidney? You definitely could. Wait, is that what I want to do? I'm sorry? Yeah. Oh, that's... Okay. It's hanging, it's hanging thanks, thanks, Hat Brothers. Um, I would like to shoot two arrows at the stem connecting the kidney. What kind of arrows? I mean, the smart... The yeah, V one. arrows. She Thank you, know. Stephen. The V arrows. Yeah. The V arrows. One of your arrows misses its mark, planting itself right in the wall to your left. The Never other one it. strikes in a critical fashion. No. This is really cool. Dealing 20 damage. All right. That's like a million in Dungeons and Dragons. You notice one of the sparks goes to begin repairing the organ. The other three drop to the ground and begin hovering towards you with menace. I throw a, 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 thr- a throwing knife at the, at, the, at the spark trying to repair the wound. Okay. As you throw your throwing knife, you feel a great shock of electricity flowing through your body. Let's see if you can still hit under this increased duress. I, I should have I should have attacked the immediate threat. Perhaps. Your knife plants itself right in the back of the spidery creature, and it takes uh, how many damage? Uh, four, five damage. That's a lot for a spider, right? At the same time, it's, it's not bad for a spider, but we're talking lightning spiders, bro. Right. <laughs> At the same time, the electric bolt I mentioned earlier coursing through your system deals eight damage to you. Uh, eight, that's nothing. You feel quite, uh, quite uh, jolted by that. All right. There you go. Scorching ray! At, uh, at what? Uh, 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 Scorching ray. What? What are you shooting oh, at? At the, uh, at the stem uh, connected to the kidney. At the damaged stem. You miss. <laughs> the scorching ray flies into the wall and immediately blackens the surface, but quickly regenerates back to its former glory. I climb back up on Sharpie's shoulders and I take my emerald dagger and just jab it right up in the right up in the thing. Right up in the right up in the kidneys. Do kidneys have butts? Uh, there's a crease somewhere. I, okay, I, I, I put it in the kidney crease. Sliding your dagger directly into the crease of what we're considering a kidney for the purposes of this exercise, a burst of brilliant green light flows out. The kidney starts glowing with an intense bright light, and it's not long before shimmering bit rays of light are blasting out of the surface of the kidney. You can see all the spiders are frantically trying to heal what damage is being done, but at the same time, they can't keep up. Soon you're covered in a shower of giblets as the kidney explodes. <laughs> Giblet shower! <laughs> Giblet shower! For the next half hour, giblet shower is at 25 cents. Toby Keith's tube lover. Thanks for coming to Toby Keith's I Love Giblet Showers and Grill. Two for one giblet showers are happening at the back of the bar, in front of the bar. You can peel off the lacquer and eat it. 
Line dancing's coming up. You hoochie coochie till you smoochie doochie. We're gonna play uh, footage of, of, of weapons tests uh, on, the, on, the, on the video wall. All right, so uh, do we did we kill this thing? And just pray for another war. We're just gonna get down on our knees and just pray for war. The organ has exploded, but your actions have pissed off those things I was talking about, and they shoot lightning towards you all. Lightning lightning spiders? The the giblets aren't harmful, right? The giblets are just embarrassing and gross. I shoot two sleep arrows. But not before taking 12 lightning damage. Everyone. Spencer, are we okay? I don't know. How much HP do you have? How much what do I have? HP, that thing that tracks how dead you are. I should really teach you guys how to play this at some point. I didn't know hit, I didn't know hit points were called HP. I thought that was a sauce you put on French fries at a pub. Well, you do that too. I, I have 27 HP. Damn. Well, now you have 15. All right, Spencer. I thought we were friends. All right. No, you can get thing. hurt and be friends. No, it's okay. It just I, really seems like we're not friends right now. We spend a lot of time together. It's fine. I, I go into a, I go into a rage, a, a barbarian rage. Okay. And, and, I, and I start spinning faster and faster and faster, and I plunge myself with my with my sword attack into the thing and try to take out as many as lightning spiders as I can. All right. Let's see here. Yeah. That's a tricky move. I'm going to call that an advanced cleave action. Yeah, that's what I call it. <laughs> You mean an, 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 an ACA? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I could have said, I could have told you I, w- I want to do an ACA, but these fuckers, they wouldn't have done it. Oh, man, I like your pollen head shake. Is there... <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Aaron. <laughs> swinging your sword I'm in a circular fashion. <laughs> You strike the first spider. There's spiders everywhere. Jeff, Jeff, you're Millering. You're Millering. <laughs> Sorry, Cha Cha. You only managed to deal eight to the spider, but as it was already wounded from your earlier dagger, it falls to the ground and dissipates into white energy. What the, the, the kidney does? The kidney? No, the kidney's already exploded. Oh, they're giblets, yeah. Yeah. I, I, I feel bad for killing a spider. <laughs> I was in Charlotte's Web, you know. <laughs> it says crunchy. crunchy. <laughs> I'd put it at Mulrain's turn. Mulrain, you're up. Do a thing. <laughs> Do a thing. I Let's like see. vagueness. I'm going to take two of my V arrows. Nice. I'm going to shoot them at the thing that's the best. Shoot at. You pick the best of three identical enemies to fire at. And firing two arrows. I shoot them at a lightning creature. Yeah, those are the ones we're fighting. Firing them directly at the lightning creatures, both of your arrows make their mark, dealing. And. 11 damage apiece. The spiders are wounded. They scuttle. Up the ceiling and dissipate in the ceiling. Yay! They dissipate. Kidney beaters. Uh, who, who wants giblets? Valison pipes up. He's like, Yeah, I make sandwiches out of this shit, man. I'll, I'll take a giblet sandwich. Hell yeah! Let me get my bread of holding. <laughs> it's just regular uh, bread. It's just regular bread. Yeah. I, I cast uh, delicious mustard. Nice. It's it's spicily effective. <laughs> All right. Well, that's that seems like a yeah. yeah, yeah I, I think it's a good place to stop. Cliffhanger. Cliffhanger. We're two thirds through the infinite fish. 